I want to look at radio waves. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a shape here, and it's basically going to be on top of the ball here. It, it doesn't really matter like how accurate it is. It just needs to be fairly, uh, you know. So we're going to look at this ellipse, and we're going to grab the position of it. Press Y to make sure we've got this somewhere in the center. Uh, then what I'm going to do is I want to use this radio waves effect, which is really, really cool. So we're going to leave the position of the circle here, but we're going to actually make the uh, radio waves effect follow the path of the ball. So you can see I've got this radio waves effect. So we'll put this into shape layer one. And then we're going to put into the radio waves effect, we're going to put where the producer point is. We're going to put that in. And you see you get this interesting effect. And the things that you want to keep in mind is we could do a lifespan of two seconds and a frequency of eight. And now, now let's take a look and see what happens. Because this, this, this is a much more powerful effect. I can easily imagine using something like this in video. Like you could use this in like a football video. Like literally, I mean, I guess it is a football thing, but especially when it's still, you get that really cool like oscillating effect. This is like going through uh, water. That's like a water sort of effect. Um, I can actually just change the color to see it a bit more clearly. Yeah, there's lots of cool settings you can change on this as well. Um, but definitely one to use though. Anyway, that's uh, about all to look at here. So thanks for watching.